PixiGS doesn't come with a built-in sound system, so we'll use a third-party library for that instead. First, let's pause Vite for a moment and install Howler, one of the most popular libraries for handling audio. After installing, we'll import the Howl class and create an instance of it. The configuration object includes several properties, but the only one we need is SRC, which is essential for specifying the path to the audio file we want to play. Speaking of paths, ensure you've placed an audio file in the public folder of your project directory. Next, we need to play the sound. Finally, your browser might not play the audio because it requires a triggering action, like a mouse click to start playing.